Hey guys, it's the 4K Lowdown coming to you with my Blu-ray Steelbook collection. This is part 10. Let's get it going. So I'm going to start off with a trilogy. And I love the books, so the movies I had to get. This is Maze Runner. And it's a really cool color on the box. It almost looks like it's got texture to it, but it doesn't. It's Blu-ray and DVD. Nice artwork. Let's keep it rolling with Scorch Trials. It's really these are really simple designs that I like. Backs, you know, backs don't have hardly anything on it. Like I said, it's really interesting. I don't know if you can see it, but the the case looks like it's textured. It looks like you could touch it and feel feel the bumps on it. But it's not smooth as an Android's butt. And then the third one is the Death Cure. Nice, uh, nice blue cover. Nice blue case to it. Again, it looks like it's textured but it's not oh and this one actually has something on the back and that's the the logo for wicked wicked is good let's pull all that stuff out uh, not so much artwork on the discs with this one but you see the the names i don't know if you can make them out the the names on the inside cover, I thought that was kind of cool. <laughs> All right, coming up next is the embossed, and this is kind of like the Italian job that I have. This is Mission Impossible Ghost Protocol, and again, you can feel, I don't know if I'm going to try to do this again. Weep. Or you might be able to catch the... Hang on, Tom Cruise. Tom Cruise's nose sticks out. It's just, it's just so funny to me. But there's the back. I don't know if you can make it out, but it's the the scene where he's outside on the building. It's kind of cool. Ooh, nice. All right. This is a nice one. So this is uh, my Scream Factory steelbook of my bloody valentine and this has got to be one of my favorite steelbooks it's just got a beautiful design on it dig in the scream factory boutique titles i've got a few of these From the heart comes a warning, filled with bloody good cheer. Remember what happened as the 14th draws near. The midnight hour is close at hand. Creatures crawling search of blood to terrorize your neighborhood. Coming up next is... 
and I, I absolutely hate this movie, but my kids loved it. So this is Nightmare Before Christmas. And I think the reason why I hated it was because we played it so often when the kids were little. Um, and then that's the back. Now, the cool part about this thing is um, it's, it's embossed. So you can actually feel the skull and you can feel the girl in the grave in the, in the back. But the... Um, the white parts on the outside, they actually glow in the dark. So when you turn off the light, you can actually see it. And uh, I don't know if I want to try it or not. Nah, I'm not going to try it. But that's the inside. Pretty cool. On to the next. So we have the original... Nine Mile on Elm Street, which had to get. This is my number four horror movie of all time. Came out in 1984. Will I get the 4K of this if it comes out? Might. I just might do that. Okay. Up next is Now You See Me. And I like the, the rustic cover on this. It makes it look like a playing card. And... That's just a great movie. All right, let's keep this train moving. Next one is Oblivion. You know, Oblivion originally got a bad rap, but I like the fact that most most people actually like this movie now. Um, this would be one that would be good in 4K, I think, with all the special effects and sci-fi stuff. Um, And the last one for today is One Cut of the Dead, which is a really, it's a really funny zombie movie, so, uh, Zomcom. And I got advertisements from Shutter on this, so I guess, yeah, it's a Shutter movie, so it's pretty awesome to get this in Steelbook. All right, that is it for round 10 of my Blu ray Steelbook collection. Coming up will be part 11, and we're going to keep this rolling. Uh, definitely like and subscribe to get new content because I'll be putting stuff in here all the time. Until then, we'll see you next time. Take care, everybody.